is a go-to quick meal for college students and frankly anyone looking to save a buck. But there is a stomach-turning viral video that could have you rethinking ramen noodles for dinner. An experiment by local doctors allows you to see what happens after you eat the processed food. You're inside the belly of someone who's just sucked down a package of ramen noodles. A meal college kids and people on a budget know well. Chemically preserved for a long shelf life, no one's ever seen what happens to the noodles once inside the stomach, until now. People just have this macabre interest in terms of what's going on in their bodies when they can't see it. Now we can. 32 hours of video thanks to this. A smart pill, a camera the size of a multivitamin swallowed at mealtime. What we're seeing here uh, is a stomach contracting back and forth, back and forth as it's trying to grind up the ramen noodle. For comparison, the study subjects also ate fresh, homemade ramen noodles on a different day. Here's a look at both. At 20 minutes, and two hours, a striking difference. The most striking thing about our experiment, when you look at a time interval, one hour or two hours, we noticed that processed ramen noodles were less broken down than homemade ramen noodles. The study cannot conclude processed is harmful. In fact, this study is too small to be conclusive about anything, but millions are drawing their own conclusions. I realize that the video is out there it's provocative. Dr. Kuo does plan more research that may reveal whether the slower digestion affects the amount of nutrients the body absorbs. It's still not entirely clear the impact it has on the GI tract. Many things are good in moderation. I think processed foods uh, still need to be investigated further. Dr. Kuo runs the gastrointestinal lab at Mass General, and I wanted to know if after watching the video, he would still eat ramen noodles. He said not only would he, he does in moderation.